Hello Leo, it's Milady from Milady's Lake Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly weekend, sorry, weekly love reading for the week of hmm, June 17th through the 24th, 2019. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Kranz. I want to thank everybody for like, share, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. Oh, goodness. All right, guys. Let's get this show on the road. So, that fell out. So, it seems like somebody's been sending, getting sent messages. I feel like somebody's been doing a lot of meditating. Or this could be a sign to tell you to start meditation so that you can get the messages that are being sent to you. Okay? So that you can hear them. All right? All right. Let's cut the cards. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Leo, Leo, Leo. All right. So it seems like you are definitely being sent messages here. Okay. I do feel like somebody just be having like energy, like bursts of energy where they just very excited. I feel like, I feel like a little bit bipolar a little bit. Um, I feel like just all out of the blue somebody be crying out of the blue somebody just be happy um but i do feel like it's messages being sent to you and i feel like little things that you see throughout the day is is changing your 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 emotions changing your attitude because you being sent this messages but you're not listening okay so of course this isn't for everybody but i do feel like um if this is you having these uh mood swings that you don't understand it's time to do some meditation and try to figure out what your spirit guides are trying to tell you, okay? All right, for the rest of us. All right, so we got the endurance card. So I feel like you may be doing something, dealing with somebody, and you need to cut it out, okay? Something needs to stop, okay? And you just can't take anymore, okay? Somebody, somebody pushed their self to the limit. All right, so we have the Reclaiming Your Authenticity card. So I do feel like somebody is dealing with someone who is different from them socially, okay? Or just dealing with a social cliche, all right? Is it cliche? No, I don't know if it's cliche, but just something that's not socially accepted. Okay, I'm going to look up cliche after this, unless you guys want to put it in the comment box. <laughs> all right, let's, oh, goodness, that's a lot. All right, so we got the sisterhood card reversed here. So I do feel like there's some people you're dealing with. Um, of course, these people aren't your friends. I feel like whatever this is that you want to stop doing, I feel like they're pushing you to keep doing it, okay? So if you're in a relationship where you're not being treated right because of um, your race or uh, thought process or whatever, uh, they're telling you to stay there, be strong, be in there. You know, in reality, they just want to talk nasty about you behind your back, okay? But let's see what this is. They flew on the floor. These got far, so I'm going to have to move some stuff around. Uh, all right, first we got this back. So this is like the messages. Somebody's not listening to their messages. And I should have picked this up when I got up in the first place. All right, so these were sideways. Um, so we have the soul cage. So I feel like somebody may be holding someone back, um, acting like a soulmate. I feel like some secrets are getting ready to come out. I feel like the secrets are coming out from these fake friends. That's what I was just saying. Everything you tell these people or everything these people get you to do, they go talk about you behind your back, okay? So I feel like you already got a sense of, like, dang, how everybody keep knowing What's going on? Of course, you got to set up a trap and tell them something that you know isn't true and pre-warn all the people you know they're going to talk. I mean, it's about a, a, it's a little bit manipulative, but if you got friends like this and you already expect suspect them as being this person, you need to find out or you need to just cut them short. All right. Get rid of them. You don't have to go through all that. But that's completely up to you. All right, let's see what this sisterhood reverse is about for the Leo. All right. Mm. All right, so it seems like these people are talking about how this person um, that you're dealing with don't want to be around you. This could be the other way around, too. 
how this is could be your partner and how their friends or family are talking about them okay uh but this is they're talking about how they don't want to be around you, how they don't treat you like you're supposed to be treated. Uh, but I feel like they're doing this all behind your back, but in your face. I feel like they're telling you to um, push forward, see how much you can go, how much you can do, you know. But they're laughing at you. But you are already like, I'm getting ready to quit, okay? I'm not just going to quit this relationship that I've been trying hard for, for months, weeks, years. Um, but... I'm going to quit this friendship because they keep telling me to do stupid stuff. Like, every time I'm around y'all, something go wrong. Okay? All right. So, we got Arrival Homeland, okay? So, it's basically like, yeah, somebody's getting ready to end this. All right? They realize and understanding that in this relationship with these situations... This is why nothing's going right because I'm dealing with a lot of negative people. Now, you can cut your family off too. You know, it's okay to not talk to them. And if you come back later on, talk to them and they still act in the same way, whatever. Okay? You know, you can love them from somewhere else. I love you, but I don't like you. Okay? All right. So, mm. All right, so I'm hearing a couple of things from here. So I do feel like the person that you're dealing with either started a new relationship or started a new relationship and somebody's possibly pregnant on the outside. But whatever this situation is with something new on the outside, these friends are telling you to stay, stay, stay so they can ha, ha, ha. And it's just like you are like, I can't deal with this. This is it. This was the final thing. I'm not about to sit up here and take anymore. I don't care what you did. Or, or what I did or what happened, this is it, okay? I don't care how many years I spent here, not another minute, okay? All right, y'all saw that jump out right on there. Oh, man, the whole deck is just jumping, 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 jumping. All right, yes. So, yep, you're about to be free from this situation, and it's because this new beginning, okay? And then these friends, too. Oh, I feel like when I see this friends card, it's like I'm seeing sitting in there and I'm, I'm seeing and I'm feeling this them saying this stuff and I I feel like I, I am you at this time and it's making me sick to hear the stuff that's coming out of their mouth it's making me sick it's making my neck feel like I'm being choked that's the, that anxiety that anxiety so this is not the first time you got the anxiety around these people but you just leave and come back like oh you know it was just that day maybe it was me no it wasn't you you're getting these signs and this anxiety and stuff because you need to stay away from these people because these people don't mean you no good, okay? All right, so we got the baggage card here. So it's time to declutter. It's time to get rid of all this extra baggage. These people are not doing anything for you but making your life worse, okay? Or making your life bad, you know? So oh, time to go. All right. So, yes, this makes me feel like, of course, you're not enduring with all this crazy stuff. And we got the water flight, the weight lifted, the burdens lifted. So, it's definitely, you're about to get, get away from it, get out of it. That's enough. I don't want no more drama. All right, what's going on with the Leo? Leo, love reading for June 17th through 24th. 2019. Leo, 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 what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got the Six of Cups here. So I do feel like somebody is going to find some emotional balance here, but this also makes me feel like if this stuff did not happen, it's getting ready to, okay? All right, so we got the six of wands. So we got two sixes. So maybe six weeks, six days. Okay. I feel like definitely less than six months. Okay. So let's keep going. So I do feel like some kind of success is going to be here emotionally. Um, and when it, in regards to love also. also. All right. So, yes, we got the four cups reversed. I do feel like fakeness is getting ready to come um, be unveiled unveiled revealed okay uh i do feel like this four cups reverse says good things are on their way okay 
Good things. Success and good things. Awesome. Yep, but of course, you got to release, release the negativity. Okay, yes. So, I do feel like, of course, sadness is going to come there. All right, but I do feel like your life is going to go better. But I do feel like the sadness of um, needing to end these relationships. There is going to be a loss, okay? Oh, we got four, five, six here. All right, so we got the two of wands here. So I do feel like somebody is um, thinking about where they're moving to. Should I move uh, somewhere new? Should I move back home? Uh, to home state, home city, home with parents, whatever. Um, but I do feel like somebody may end up moving where they feel like is backwards. But I feel like whatever this is, is going to help them have stability. All right. But I do feel like success is in whatever this is you do. So you go forward, you go backward. I feel like su success is on the way. Okay. All right. So we got the father of cups here. So I do feel like some kind of uh, loyalty is getting ready to come to you. Okay. Uh, but I feel like it's going to be self loyalty. I do feel like uh, somebody's building a wall here. I do feel like somebody is going to. I feel like somebody's going to be free from people for a while, and I feel like they're only going to trust themselves, okay? I feel like self-trust or maybe wherever this back, like could back parents or something like that, or older siblings, okay? No, nope, I don't know. I feel like more so of parents. All right, so I do feel like somebody's going back there for, for that. Um, I do feel like somebody's going to find stability in their self and freedom in their self and in um, this place they're moving back to. All right, what is this? Five of Cups. All right, so we got the seven, seven of wands. So I do feel like somebody's fighting hard emotionally. There is going to be a hard fight emotionally to actually stay away from these people, especially like even if they negative, they were company, okay? So you used to talking to these people every day, every two days, every couple of hours, and now you got to cut all that off. Whew, that is definitely going to be hard. It's going to be some mental stuff there too, not just like a... You know, I'm going to block this person, turn their phone off, blah, all that stuff. You know, you also got to train yourself not to call them, okay? All right, what we got here? Yes, definitely. So, it seems like you got some choices to make here. I feel like you made your mind up. This makes me feel like there is some moving away or, or moving back somewhere going to happen. I feel like somebody is going to cut people off, but right now... Somebody just making a choice about everything they need to do. And that is all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.